Hello, St. Malachy students and families. This is Mr. Dwyer. It is Thursday, July 16th. Uh, I'm sending this video out today to share some information about our plans to reopen and start the school year uh, this coming August 25th, which will be our first day of school. Um, I just want to say that, you know, there is a lot of uncertainty right now, and um, there's a lot of stories going back and forth about what we should be doing and when and where and why. So I just want to share that um, the reason that we do want to reopen our school is first and foremost because we believe that students um, deserve and need the opportunity to learn uh, each and every day of the school year. And we are committed to providing that learning opportunity in the best possible way that we are able. Uh, we hope and we believe that if it is safe and possible to do so, that delivering instruction in person in the classroom is the best way for students to learn. That's why we're uh, making these plans and putting these steps in place to make sure that it is safe for students to return and that they will be safe and taken care of when they are at school. Um, we've always had the belief in open arms and open doors here at St. Malachy, and we want to continue to have open arms and open doors for learning again this year. Even though it will look very different and there will be some challenges, we are committed to working with each of you and your children to make this a successful year, even though it will not be the norm. So let me share a couple of the points with you from our plan. Um, and I hope to uh, have further communication on these points with everyone as we go along. So first of all, um, I want to let everyone know that our plan, if we are uh, allowed by Governor Pritzker to reopen, we will plan to reopen with full five-day attendance for all students, um, and we will continue with that um, for as long as we are able to do so uh, safely and with uh, a healthy environment for everyone from students to parents to teachers to staff. Our first day will be Tuesday, August 25th. Um, we will offer the full complement of subjects and extended day care will continue to be offered for families who need it, who, who are working, uh, who need that care. But we will place an emphasis on safe and healthy learning environments. So this means that teachers, students, and staff will all be required to wear masks throughout the school day. Um, we know that this may be a challenge for some students, especially younger students, However, this is being required by the state of Illinois at this time, and it has been recognized as the best way to limit the spread of COVID-19. And so that is what we are planning for at this time. We will also be performing temperature checks upon entry every day to the school, and students will not be able to enter the building if they are feeling sick. If students are displaying any symptoms of respiratory illness, they will need to stay home um, and we will have protocols for how students can engage in online learning when they are at home. Um, we do expect there to be more days that students are learning at home with this requirement, and we really need parents' cooperation in order to not have sick students coming to school, which could potentially lead to the spread of the uh, COVID virus. Um, Instead, what we're going to do is keep students to their homeroom class as much as physically possible. So there won't be students moving around the building for things like lunch or specials classes. We'll have uh, things including special teachers come to the students' class to provide those services throughout the day. In conjunction with that, we're going to um, promote outdoor recess as much as possible during which time students would be able to remove their masks and um, get a little bit of, of a break from that if they were able to do so safely. Uh, two other things we're gonna do is increase our daily cleaning and disinfecting schedule to make sure that um, the environment is as germ-free as possible and also to uh, increase our one-to-one um, -one technology capabilities so that students will have access to technology both in the classroom and potentially at home should they need to go to online learning for either short or longer periods throughout the year. 
So with this information, this is not a full and comprehensive plan. We are going to continue to communicate on a weekly basis going forward as our plan continues to develop. Um, we understand that people may be feeling uncertain at this time, uncertain if they feel confident sending their student back at all, uncertain if they feel comfortable with their student wearing a mask, um, or other parents may feel um, relief that, that there will be a chance to send students back. So and that students will be able to continue learning. So we recognize that people are coming at it from a number of different perspectives, but wanting to reiterate that our values come from our uh, belief in God and our belief in Jesus, that every child is precious, every family is important, and that we want to be a place of learning for our students and our families in the best way and the safest way that we possibly can. So that's what we are committed to. I look forward to continuing to communicate with you each week via the Thursday Thriller. Uh, so please continue to check your email for these messages. One thing you can do for us to help us in our planning to be as safe as possible is to register your child if you are uh, planning to return so that we can set up the classrooms in the safest and best way possible and that we can plan accordingly. Please email Yvonne Corona in order to uh, re-register. Or feel free to even reach out to me at Patrick Dwyer at stmalachychicago.com to ask any other questions about our reopening plan. Again, we thank you for all your cooperation, and we are praying for your safety and your health this summer. We miss all the students and families incredibly, and we are looking forward to seeing people back, though it will be quite different in a few weeks. So have a good summer. Stay safe. Stay healthy. And we look forward to being in touch with you soon.